Nairobi Governor Johnson Sakaja has downplayed the row between him and Deputy President Rigadi Gashagwa over planned reforms in Nairobi City. The government instead blamed those he termed as detractors, a governor, I should say, detractors for fueling a non-existent feud. Citizen TV's Ayub Abdikadir reports. Governor Sakaja, who attended a church service at the Pentecostal Evangelistic Fellowship of Africa in Nairobi, South Bay Estate, called out people he said are hell-bent on sowing discord between him and the national government. Those who are trying to create a tiff, um, a storm in a teacup, um, as it were, um, I have a lot of respect for all leaders. Uh, you will never hear me speaking ill about any leader, um, about the president or the deputy president. We speak uh, privately, and uh, there are those who are trying to take advantage, you know, and especially coming from other parties, from other parts of the country, let them leave our issues to us. We'll continue working properly with the national government. <laughs> Sakaja reiterated that he had no problem with Deputy President Regadi Gashagwa. He, however, told of those trying to arm twist him to respect the established constitutional delimitation of roles between the two levels of government. There are people who try to sow division where it does not exist. The Deputy President of Kenya must be respected, and the national government has its role. But the county also has its role, and the county also will be respected and play its role. It is our. His statement coming against the backdrop of recent remarks by Deputy President Regadi Gashagwa of a plan by the Nairobi City County Administration to block Matatus from accessing the city's central business district. India, India. On his administration's closure of noisy nightclubs in residential areas in Nairobi, Governor Sakaja reiterated that City Hall will not revise its stands in what he says is a move that will create a city of order. Najua umesikia kuna siasa mingi Nairobi kwa sababu tunajaribu a new vision. Our city cannot remain how it has always been. We must improve it. Kweli mtasimama na mimi tukiimprove Nairobi. Tuki implement a new vision and a new way of doing things. Because we can't do things the same way and expect different results, that is madness. The city county's fourth governor also appealed to residents of the county to celebrate their ethnic diversity and live in harmony. Ayub Abdikadir, Citizen TV, Nairobi.